now you're welcome to the second part of the modeling okay so now that we are done modeling the column we can now go to the, the beam we can now model the beam so let's start from story 12 as well just go to story 12 then you go up here this is for column and this is for beam okay so pick your beam then i'm still going to pick i section that will be universal beam so i'll pick the ub here i'll pick this one the 179 by 102 this one 179 by 102 so click on ok then ok then pick from center to center to center center and then back to center then you can close move to the next story pick beam again okay you see we still have the same section right so just do the same thing just center to center make sure it's at the center then you can close move to the the next story so pick your beam then center to center to center center and back to center then you can close move to story 9 pick the beam again okay so from here to here then here here and then back here then you can close you go to story 2 you can pick the beam from here to here then to the center center and back to the center then you can close and let's see the 3d okay so now this is how it looks like in the 3d now we are completely done with the beam modeling we shall move to the the bracings all right okay now so let's begin with the bracing okay so for the bracing you come here this is bracing you can see this is column this is beam and this is um bracing so click the brace so for this level i'll brace this column and this column just click the two columns when you click the two column so you can now select the section you want for the bracing so when you click on this profile just um, double click on it then you can see the several sections you can use so i'll be using the angle bar i'll just pick the lowest one which is 90 by 90 okay and then the thickness of 8 8 mm so click on ok ok then for the brace type i'll prefer x brace you can use k you can use the v but i'll use x bracing all right so you can just decide to change as much as you like so okay so i'll have this and then for this other one so you click on this and then you click on this so the last settings i made will still be there so but i don't want to change it i want to use the last settings so you click on ok and then i have that click on this and then click on this so okay click on this and then this okay all right that's good so we we'll move forward with that you can just click the beam the upper and the lower beam yeah you have the bracing this and then this you have the bracing this and then this okay thank you this and this we have the bracing then this this yeah here and then here brace here and here 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 okay and then here here yes and then up and here yeah that's fine then we are done okay so now we are done with the with the modeling this is all for the modeling so we are going to do the analysis and then the the design okay 
So let's see how it goes.